So welcome back. I have to do it as a two part series due to my alarm going off and cutting the video short. So I got as far as talking about the Jolly Green and this part here. This is actually a foreign object uh, deflector. So what was happening was, was things was getting sucked in into the engines and that's what that was uh, placed on there to deflect it. Now I managed to get a scrapped Seeking from eBay which had those parts. Um, this is a kit that I quite like. This is the Heller Little Trojan Attack Aircraft. Uh, I think it's called the Fennec in French service. I've done it with a better rocket pod. It's got the two 50 cals on each side and a Little Mark 82 bomb. Then we've got a Amacom uh, Chinook CH47C model, which I repainted. That's the Desert Storm one. And then finally, a Hobby Boss CH47E model, which um, I repainted. Now, I have got six Hueys to build, so you won't see any Hueys because I keep putting off building them. Now, let's move to the air war up north. So we've got the Javelin. So circa 1967, I've done a separate video on this. This is Maisie, the MiG killer. There's her mission marking. She's got the silver underneath scheme she's got two red top missiles missiles in madagascan service are white if they're air-to-air -air missiles or gray not the silver as they should be and there she is in the southeast asian camouflage scheme a frog kit with a freight dog resin nose we've got the f5c sakoshi tiger which has got two rocket pods the white parts and two bombs um, these were used by Madagascar in close air support and they did venture up north when fitted with chaff and flare pods. Got a Buccaneer to repaint. Got Phantom Fever, which I believe I have covered separately. And I'm going through these aircraft and decaling them correctly with the Madagascan roundels. So these are work in progress. B-57 suppression of air defence with the... AGM 78 arm. We've got more Phantoms here and then we've got an F5E from 1975. So in my what if universe the war dragged on a bit longer to the end of the 70s. That was due to the Americans and the Madagascans stopping the attack in 1975 and South Vietnam eventually fell as part of a peace treaty arranged by Carter in 1979 when the Americans were distracted by what was happening in Iran. Now this is a RC-6B, this is the older Helikit, which I've converted to a snooping aircraft. So I've added a big radar underneath at the front and in the centre. I've used Buccaneer uh, data link pods on the wings and this is essentially uh, your snooping aircraft. This is an electronic warfare aircraft. The DC-6 seemed like a good idea to convert it. It is the ancient heli, heli kit and it is one of my ancient builds. So um, at that time, I wasn't very good at working on seams and sanding and doing everything. I'm still not great at it. Um, so there we go. That's the ones that are built. Um, in addition to these, there are... KC-135A strato tanker to build. There's a C-130P um, combat crown uh, to build. That's an Italeri conversion. There was about six Hueys. There's another Javelin. There's two Lightnings and there's two more Phantoms. Um, there's Mohawks. There's a Bronco forward air control aircraft. Um, and there's more CH-46Es. So there is a lot to do um, to complete this collection. Probably another table's worth of aircraft to build. Um, I hope you've enjoyed this little view into my made-up silly world. Uh, let me know what you think. Like, comment and subscribe. Um, I hope you've enjoyed this and I will keep building. And at some point by 2040, the collection will be complete.